Hey, what is up everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. This is episode 51, um, last episode we did the big world tour and the world download. I am back and very excited. I have done some work on this circle um, of doom, and uh, there's no more dirt in the circle. But there is still a ton of stone, and this needs to go down to bedrock level, pretty much. Um, so... I have, I have actually died since last episode, and uh, I was AFK at my Blaze farm, and I forgot that Blaze spawn at at, le at light levels eleven, not eight like other mobs. I completely forgot that when I made the Blaze farm. Even that was a long time ago. That was like episode twenty one or something, and yeah, a Blaze spawned. Like I was always wondering how there's Blaze there when I. Um, when I go there, and yeah, a blaze spawned, killed me whilst I was AFK. Um, I came, I came back to my keyboard too late to notice, and uh, yeah, I lost all my stuff. But after a few hours of work, I regained all of it. Um, in fact, it's even better than last time. But what's the what's the best thing that I've done? I have got a whole bunch of tools here, which are for work. So. Um, maybe not all of them, but most of them have efficiency 5 and mending. Um, yeah, I just have 3 picks to put efficiency 4 books onto. And then I've got some work shovels, um, which I used. I nearly broke one of them, but it's all good, it's all good. Um, and yeah, just dirt took a lot of chests. However, this was like a really big amount of dirt, but the reason, like the biggest reason why I'm building here is because I have the storage room right here, um, and this has an unlimited space pretty much. Um, I need to make like one of these big column things just for dirt, and then I need like a whole aisle for just stones. That that's what I really need. So I'm gonna I'm gonna relocate some of my stuff from there, eventually. Um, and also got a whole bunch of pigs trapped here. And guess what? Like after so many hours after me dying, I still don't have an arrow on me. So the bow is useless. Uh, but yeah, um, got two beacons here. Um, speed one, regen, and haste two. All all you really need, and uh, you can just mine away. Um, I'll be moving the beacon down further um, as we progress here. It's going to be in the very center of this cylinder. And uh, yeah, I've been chatting for a while now. What I really want to do is like get a second computer and like possibly play on that and then somehow get another account and log in with that onto this and record a time lapse. But <clears throat> too much trouble for me. And besides, I don't have a second computer anywhere near me. I'll be able to do that once I get my good PC though. But yes, uh, I just want to, I just want to get it down to say, Y60 today. By the end of the day, I'll be. That's my goal for today. But yes, this has taken many hours already. <laughs> and also very nice. I've got a blaze farm like right there, so I can repair my tools. This is yeah. Oh yeah. The only problem is is ghost blocks and uh like you need to reload the world not just reload the chunks but reload the whole world so you need to like relog and stuff and it's really annoying or you can just leave the area and unload the chunks but yeah when i came when i came here for the for the episode there were like 20 pieces of dirt randomly in places that i didn't notice before Is my sound up? That would explain a lot. That would explain a lot <laughs> because I must have had I must have had it like that for at least a few hours now. Um, because uh, when I was working on the dirt, I couldn't hear myself picking up the items, even though I pretty much had no inventory space. That might be the reason, though, why. But never mind. I, I'll just. I'll pause recording and work on this for some time now. Well, I would say substantial progress has been made. Um, 
over half is now gone and a bit more to go um, I'll probably be able to finish this off with this pick if not then doesn't matter I'll just get another pick out of my toolbox but yeah good progress here um, might actually finish this by episode 100 well um, this looks pretty damn good I'd say um, Although this does need to go down to Y, uh, this needs to go down another 60 blocks pretty much, and I only did, I don't know, like 4 or 5, in most areas it was only 4 blocks high, so yeah, um, got quite a bit more work to do, but I've been doing this for about 50 minutes now, um, and I kind of want to take a break from it, and I need to repair my tools now, so that's what I'm going to do now, and then I'll I'll see what else I can do um, before I end the episode here. I'm probably gonna go back to my first base and do something there. Um, I don't know, work on the tunnel or something like that. I'll come up with something. Alright, so just hopped quickly into Creative World. So I needed a new project to do, so I decided that I should maybe try to complete an old idea of for a project which is an automatic armor swapper um, as you can see just very much in my top right corner you can see a, an older design of it and it did not work so I'm gonna try to recreate it again um, it's definitely not easy to do um, but if I can actually do it that would be very cool because I would definitely put it into my world um, and it's a very big redstone project, so... Um, how do we want this? Well, let's just have power here for the moment. Ah, right. I didn't, I didn't receive it. Okay. Got it. So we have the line here. Okay. So I think I would want to just have it go off here, do a small loop like this. Uh, let's do an extra block just in case we need any extra space. Um, just like so and let's just do that yeah that should work um, gonna put a detector rail here can I just say this is not easy I, I literally just had like two minutes to think up of something that might possibly work so if the rail automatically goes to the right, then the detector rail probably won't work. Uh, let's put a minecart on. Okay. So this may not work unless I do this. Ah, that stupid southwest southeast or whatever, I don't care what rule it is, uh, won't let me make this work. Unless I have the rail here. Oh yes, this might work. Um, if I have the rail here, and uh, let's get redstone. Okay, so a little while later, uh, more like uh, six hours later, um, I have pretty much done this. Um, okay, let's make this a bit more realistic. How How is it actually going to be like? It's going to go up like this. Power rail, power. Uh, it's going to be something more like this. Just making this more realistic because at the moment 
it's kind of like all over the place, if you know what I mean. Um, I mean with the rails here. Okay, let's have it. Let's have them all join into the onto this line. Um, I should have probably done this like ASAP, not and not have waited this long. But you know, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, like a so redstone. No. Yes, good stuff. Okay, and we've got it. Um, so this is a very, very much of a repeating pattern. Um, er, the only thing you need to do to add on is to have basically more, more torches here connected to a longer line here, and have more connections to what I'm about to show you. But as you can see, I'm just going to demonstrate quickly first. This minecart would go there. Then this would go to the next place. Uh, okay. It went to the next place. And then because they're both taken up, this this one would just go off. Um, and if I was to say take this out, take this minecart out, so the minecart in front of it is still there. If I was to take this out, it would go to the right. If I was to take this out, The, the minecart would go to its rightful place as you can see and say I wanted this minecart to be the one that I basically have go off um, well let's let's take this minecart out so pretend this one is is be is the armor stand well, let's pretend that's the one that is currently at the armor stand, basically, yeah? So what would happen... Okay, I'm just checking if it's alright. Yeah, it is. Something like that would happen. And then, when that minecart is on its way back... Um... Because it cannot, it cannot quite hit. Okay, well, okay. This is a very poor demonstration. I am sorry. Um, why does uh, I don't, I don't, I don't get these toolbars? My my second toolbar keeps keeps getting broken. I don't, just don't get why. Okay, so imagine we we have requested for this minecart. Right, like a so, this one would go down. Um, okay, and we've got the minecart there. This minecart has just left. Um, it is at our station. We send it back, having requested the other one. Here's what would happen. Because here. When the, when the minecart that goes there passes over this, it triggers for this minecart to go and just barely going over this rail here, right? But this minecart it needs to go here and somehow trigger that one. That is why I have this line here. Um, it just works something like this. Very smart, isn't it? So what it does is it detects when there's a minecart that is being requested. Well, doesn't this thing doesn't detect, but if there is a minecart being requested, this would be up and allowing for a signal to go to the rail, right? Pretty simple. And so to do that, it would need to have a really complex system kind of like this. Wait, wait a second. Yeah, yeah, it's all right. It's all right. Um, I nearly confused myself with my own redstone. I'm a genius. So what we've got here, um, I'm, I know I'm explaining this very well. Um, we've got trip wires detecting when the minecart is there. Um, so 
it would send out the signal to here to the all to the um, requester I, as I'm gonna call it and it also sends a signal to this thing over here so that when the minecart is here this does nothing apart from power powering this rail um, and it does that pretty simple in a pretty simple way got a repeater here locking this on when it's off and then when when you go over this this would do anything but when the minecart isn't here and you go over this this would activate the this and make it turn so can I just say I'm very proud of this um, and yes this is pretty much all I've done now I I want to have about five or six armor stands so this would be repeated about four more times so I can do that right now um, because I have time to waste in this episode let me do it with you so <laughs> let's do a bit of a tutorial I'll do a, a proper tutorial in it what some other day like I always say and then never do for my brilliant redstone ideas um, I should really do more tutorials because I actually have pretty good ideas and then I never get credited for anything and then someone else comes up with pretty much the same idea and then just like yeah I totally came up with this and then they don't even know that I made it first and then and then I get so sad because I don't get no fame and yes so one two three on the fourth okay like a so this will go here like this I think yeah it yeah, just loops into here basically um, I slowed it down on purpose here I don't know why it doesn't need to be slowed down but it doesn't need to be going ultra fast either I guess I just save on gold here don't I um, need it's not necessary but it's not necessarily like to do this all you need is this block here but I do it I do this just for aesthetics really looks a lot nice and looks a lot neater safer secure you know what I mean um, it makes you actually want to use this thing so um, my god uh, let me organize another inventory real quick I don't know why it keeps getting deleted like I save it I swear um, there was something else there Oh, yeah, observer. Okay, very good. Saved it. Okay, good. So, um, we will continue this line in just a touch, um, just a second after I continue with this. Uh, I think I do something like this. Yeah, very simple, um, not much to do there. Then for the tripwires we want to do something like this, uh, great placing, right, right, I totally need, I need a new mouse, okay, I don't really, but it would be much nicer to not use a Bluetooth mouse which has an awful delay time on it, uh, that would definitely help, wouldn't it? Um, the only problem with, the, with what I have in like, in like the general problem with this would be adding on more of these so the more armor stands you have the harder it would be to add these lines because they need to be somewhat separate from each other so they don't interfere and that could be a big problem if you have a lot but there's always a way to overcome that problem um, now we we'll want some tripwire hooks and some string also so let's get a new thing here, um, trip wires, uh, it would be a miscellaneous string, just like so. I'll be putting this into my world somewhere once I find a nice enough location for it. Um, the reason I wanted to do it in creative first is because A, I have unlimited resources, B, I don't know how much space this will, this will take, so it is much more practical to use creative so that I know how much space I'll need because there's a lot of redstone here and yet a lot of gaps in between it so this would be more of a thing that would go underground or somewhere inside a hill or something so that doesn't like waste 
um, anything. You know what I mean. So it's like it's just it's just better this way. Um, do something like this. Uh, you'll want a repeater there. Line there. Line repeater. Yes. Is that the way? No. It's like this. No. Oh my god, no. What did I do? Am I going mad? Oh, it's a block before that. Of course, of course. Just don't mind anything I said in the last two minutes. Because I'm clearly going mad here. Um. Alright. I'm still doing it wrong. No, I'm not. Okay, I'm not. Where am I? I need to look at it from here. Third away. Okay, cool. It is. I am definitely crazy. Um, wait, who said that? Uh, okay. I think it would help if I, for starters, just put the redstone torch where it should be. Oh my god, this is helping already. Now, how the hell did I do this? Right, right, I did it like this. I remembers. And this is how that works. Okay. Uh, this is where the repeater goes. Yeah, that's all right. Again, great placing. Now, it is very important to have a repeater here and not here, because this repeater would otherwise power the line here, whereas it doesn't do anything here. So it's just, it just makes it actually work. Just just in case you were wondering um, if, if it makes a difference. Um, yeah, that works. All cool. Um, so now, there's one more thing to add. It is a piston over here. I uh, think like this. No, 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 no. It's a repeater there. Yeah, because otherwise it would get powered from this and would be in a constant loop. So that would be no use. And uh, I believe that is done. Just, just need to connect this up. Um, this would be connected to like a bunch of buttons and probably some piston crazy m logic stuff, which I have not figured out yet. But I'll, that's gonna be much easier than the whole of this. Um, so yes, I think that is complete. Apart from the rail, of course, and uh, a few more things. So. Do something like this. I get attached into the rail. Just like so. Not like so. Like that. Aha. You see, I'm a genius. There's a genius in this mind. Okay, so we'll want to run it along this. And uh, we'll want to add another one here. And how should we get this to work? I think simply like this would be fine. Okay, cool. 
So now if I place a minecart in there so that I can see how far the signal goes so that I don't have to work myself super hard over that. Um, now it works. Cool, and uh, let's, let's run the redstone. Yeah, it stops there. Like that. Very good, very good. So, um, the second one is still missing, okay. Let's let's run that in. Is it 12? Yeah. Okay, so that should be all good now. And uh, let's see. Yep, that works. It looks complicated, but it's not. It's just individual modules connected up using two or three lines of things. Two redstone lines and one rail. That's all it is. That connects all these. Everything else is in, in each individual module. So that should be all good. And uh, I just want to see... So if I do that... What did I do? Oh, no! Oh my god, am I that stupid? Yeah, let's break it. Wow. Okay. And now it's back to normal. Okay, uh, well, don't do what I did. Uh, that's all I can say. Got a better idea for this, actually. Let's just break this. And uh, get this one block higher. Do it like this. Very smart. Mr. Smart's Mr. Smart is here. And it should be fine now. <laughs> it just sent itself. <laughs> wow. I should probably add some kind of thing so that it just doesn't waste time and not send and send itself. It's gonna be something at the interface though, so I shouldn't worry myself about it too much here, but wow, that that was that was interesting. That was something else. But yes, um if I have time I'll hop back into my normal world and possibly find a place to dig this out in. Um I don't know. Oh yeah, I need to assume that one of them is gone. Right, right. Let's say we want this one here. Yep, that works. Cool. Okay, what about this one here? Yeah, that works. And this one again. Yep. And let's go for this one. I'm just doing diagnostic checks pretty much now. Oh no. Oh boy. Something did not go to plan. Unless I was stupid at some point. Oh no. I see. This is... Oh, it's already there. Why is it there? Wait, that's even that's the wrong one. Why is it no go here? Why no go? What's wrong with my wiring? 
Okay, this is why I did the check. <laughs> um, I thought everything was fine, but... It worked now. Oh my... This is why I don't want to be alive right now. I'll be a lot simpler. And leaning tower of minecart. Be gone. Yes, let's hop into my normal world now if if I still have time. Anyway, um, it does seem like I am out of time, about 30 minutes in, which is alright. Um, did maybe spend a little too long on the um, on on that minecart stuff there. But it should be fine. By next episode, when or whenever I get around to actually doing it, I'll have selected a good spot for it. Um, I, I don't know whether I want it to be up overground or underground yet. If it's overground, then what I would like to do is to um, like have a big kind of case in it, casing for it, and I want to part of it to be made out of glass so that you can like see see into it and see it will work. But if it's just inside a hill, then um, it it might need to like have a bit of a stairway to go down. If it, like I'm almost likely put it somewhere around here, but because most of it is gonna be higher up than the uh, the uh, what's it called the UI, so it would I would need to like go a few steps down to put it into a hill like this. Actually, when you even fit into this. Um, but yeah, you get the idea. Anyway, thanks, thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.